Hey guys, Gossip and Reactions Maristic. Antonio Brown calls Taylor Swift and Brittany Mohans white people for Trump after U.S. Open reunion. Let me tell you guys something. I'm not a hundred percent with Antonio Brown always, but this might have something in it. Because after Brittany Mohans make the comment about former President Donald Trump. Not only Taylor Swift did not rebuke that, did not come out and say, no, I'm not for him. But at the same time, she has yet to endorse VP Kamala Harris. That's one thing. Four years ago, she endorses um, President Joe Biden and Kamala Harris with no problem. But now she's taking her time and we don't think we'll ever hear her coming out to endorse VP Kamala Harris. And it's going to be heartbroken for the Swifties. Swifties for sure thinking Taylor Swift is for VP. But I think Travis Kelsey has a lot to do with it. Travis Kelsey is not for Kamala Harris. This is the reason why Taylor Swift is not going to endorse Kamala Harris. This is my take. This is my opinion. You can come after me. I don't care. That's what I think. Antonio Brown is drawing conclusions about Taylor Swift after the pop star embraced Britney Mahons at the u.s open sunday september 9th isn't it something i know taylor swift does not stand with everything former president donald trump stand for when it comes to women when it comes to democracy when it comes to freedom so for her to allow love to stop her from doing the right thing we are in trouble y'all who is sharing a photo of swift smiling next to travis kelsey at the prestigious tennis event while hugging the retired soccer player who is married to Kansas City Chiefs quarterback Patrick Mahons, the former Pittsburgh Steelers right receiver gave the trio a pointed new nickname, White People for Trump, Brown Rhodes. Like I said, I'm not always in his side, but there was something to be said to be had in this statement. Taylor Swift has not come out, and I'm sure it's because of Travis Kelsey. Travis Kelsey loves black women, but I don't think he wants to see a black woman in charge of this great country. But you know what? Together, we will prevail. We will become successful in this, and she will be the first woman and black woman to be the president of this great country. Brittany Mahans and Swift hang out at the U.S. Open comes shortly after the former drew criticisms for reportedly liking posts and comments in support of former President Donald Trump in late August, after which the twice impeached Republican candidate sung her praise in a post on Truth Social. I want to thank beautiful Brittany Mohans for so strongly wow, defending me and the fact that MAGA is the greatest and most powerful political movement in the history of our now failing country, he wrote at the time. As the Kama singer has been open in previous years about her opposition to Trump, some fans expected Swift to distance herself from Brittany uh, following the controversy. The two women who grew close over the course of the 2023-2024 NFL season seemingly didn't interact at the Chiefs game's first at the Chiefs first game of the new season on Thursday, September 5th, leading to surprise when the pair seemed closer than ever at the tournament. Like I said, yeah. I know people don't believe me sometimes when I say shit. I had a feeling Brittany Mohan was just a messenger. She was just passing the shit out there. They are not going for VP Kamala Harris. And Taylor Swift is being put in a bad situation. We know she doesn't stand with the crap from a President Trump is putting out there. But because she's so in love, blindly in love, she has to go with the shit. She because I could not imagine myself dating somebody that supported former President Donald Trump. I don't stand for shit he stand on. Racist, sexist, autocrat, everything else. Ugh, disgusting. Outrage. So I'm telling you, there was something there, yeah. There was something there. It's unfortunate. It seems like 
Taylor Swift is going to fall for the crap, she's going to make a big mistake. Because Swifties are for VP Kamala Harris. They even had a, a, a go uh, some kind of concert on Zoom. They made $114,000. Taylor Swift still didn't come out to say shit. I'm telling you. Something is up. Love is blind. Love is strong. And Travis Kelsey is the reason if Taylor Swift do not come out and support VP Kamala Harris. Let's wait and see. I still have hope. But Lord have mercy. Subscribe. Thank you for watching. That I am with Antonio Brown. I strongly believe that. Subscribe. Thank you. Bye.